Well, happening today, following those deadly explosions in neighboring Massachusetts, two lawmakers here in our state are calling on officials to conduct a comprehensive review on Connecticut's natural gas infrastructure. Channel 3's Eva Zamaris joins us. She's live in New Britain, where a hearing on this will be held later on this morning. Eva? Well, good morning to you. Both these lawmakers want to know if what happened just over the border could also happen here. They want to make sure that steps are being taken to keep everyone safe. Now, three communities in Massachusetts were impacted by a series of explosions and fires last month, which damaged or destroyed homes and businesses in Lawrence, Andover and North Andover. Now, one person was killed and dozens more were injured. It's believed high pressure in the gas line was to blame. Now, Democratic representatives Christopher Rosario of Bridgeport and Matthew Lesser of Middletown sent a letter to the chairwoman of the state's Public Utilities Regulatory Authority, wanting to know whether Connecticut residents face a similar risk. These lawmakers are hoping to get more information concerning things like staffing levels of pipeline inspectors and the extent of leak-prone gas distribution pipeline. But looking at what happened in Massachusetts uh, just this uh, last month, uh, we're really concerned that we want to make sure that we're conducting a review, making sure that uh, workers are safe on the job uh, and that our communities are safe. Now, again, that meeting that you referenced, Eric, is happening a little bit later this morning here in New Britain. It's happening at 10 o'clock this morning. Now, we did reach out to the authority ahead of this meeting today to get a comment from them. We have yet to hear back. Now, we'll have much more on this story coming up in our next half hour. Live in New Britain this morning, I'm Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.